go now? Yeah. All right. So in today's video, we're gonna go test the suspension. I did a slight modification to see if it fixes it. Before we do that, we're gonna lift the car up. Just make sure that everything's tight, do a nut and bolt check. Uh, so let's go ahead and get to it. Low probs. I made these low profile ramps because most of the ramps will still hit the front lip. So it's literally just a two by six. And then um, did a little angle on both ends equal length and we'll just drive the car up. If you all are interested in these stage wheels, uh, use code ZC10 to get 10% off. Love these, they're forged wheels, so super strong, really lightweight as well. One of the things with having white wheels is cleaning them all the time, so we'll go ahead and clean these off real quick. Watch out for that. <laughs> She's for hire, NASCAR pit crew. <laughs> We're at three minutes now for one tire. <laughs> Look at how dirty they are. I know, it's crazy. It's all good. Probably should nut and bolt check this one though real quick. So take that off. I know you just lined it up. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> practice makes perfect. Oh. You got this, so pull it out for a second. You're putting it back on. <laughs> nah, babe, this is all you. Come on. This is all you. Uh. All right, so let's just check everything real quick. Main thing that I look for is that the tie rod is tight, which it is, that the jam nut on the lower control arm is tight, which it is, and then what I do is I will wiggle the... Yeah, see how there's play? This is, this is what bothers me, but... It's the, uh, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it. Let me see if I get it there. It's the Heim joint already. That's a brand new Heim joint. So that brand new Heim joint is already bad. I reached out to TMR Customs though. I'm gonna see if they can get me, they have a beefier Heim joint. 
I'm gonna see if they can get me that. Um, on the other side, on the driver's side, this coilover, uh, basically the shaft right here, the piston, if you will, is uh, bent from, I don't know, Freedom Factory hitting a curb, who knows. All right, good news is everything is tight, so it's ready for you. You're on the clock now, NASCAR time. <laughs> And go. You're at 10 seconds already. NASCAR would have been done. Shut up. Yours aren't quite the same as yours. Oh, check you out. See what I'm what saying? Practice makes I told perfect. You I like it my way better. Well, better. yeah. It's because you got those little T Rex arms. <laughs> <laughs> wow. You're at 30 seconds. All right, I'm not trying to have you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so when I, while Nicole cleans that off, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys essentially what is happening. I might try to uh, turn the wheel so you can kind of see exactly what's happening. Just doing a nut and bolt check though. I feel like this uh, steering tie rod as well might be bent, but again, the jam nut is good. Um, this side, this side is the same thing. There's just a little bit of play in the heim joint. And you definitely notice that when you're drifting, especially at lock, there'll be a little wobble in the wheel. Even though inside and in the car, I'm keeping the wheel completely straight. At lock, there's a little bit of wobble just because it's not stable due to the Heim joint. But I'm gonna go ahead and put the key in and I'm gonna turn the car so you guys can see what exactly is going on with the coilover. All right, so I'm gonna turn the wheel and see if it'll... Yeah, you hear that noise? And it just, why did it just lock up like that? Um, I do think I want to straighten up that heim joint just because that's not a really good angle. You can see it's almost touching the misalignment spacer. So I think I want to adjust that. That's going to throw off the toe a little bit, but I think I want to adjust it. Check you out, professional. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go ahead and hit the road. Section. I'm gonna go ahead and try to hit this. It's a little busy today, so we'll see how it goes, but. So we're at the first location. We have Nicole on the line. She's gonna be spotting us. Um, it is bike week, so there's tons of traffic, but we're, we're at a spot that isn't as much traffic. So we'll see how this works. Also, these are a wider tire, so they're gonna be way grippier. So I have no idea how the car is gonna react, but we're gonna do our best. There's a kid 
kitty, don't hit it. Hit the kitty, the got black it. cat also. Alright, are the we good? Cat. Besides the cat, uh, yeah. Alright, here we go. Alright, I'm gonna run that back. Good. All right, get ready. I'm good. Oh, uh, there's there's a car coming here. No, nope, uh, don't, 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 don't. Subi, red Subi. Good after that car. Uh, so far after the red Subi. All right, let's go. Get ready. You ready? Okay. Yep. <laughs> Go now? Yeah. All right. to do a burnout. I did a quick burnout. I promise you, that guy who had to do it, yeah. it's not going to come bail you out. Right? Yeah. Hey, it's not going to take care of your this... shit when you get down to Sorry, man. It's bike week. I wanted to just show off. That's the problem. It's bike week. All right? Because all that bullshit is not to get you from jail. All right. Stop. Sorry, sir. Come out here and ride like a normal dude. All right. Come out here and be a normal dude, all right? All right, man. Here, <laughs> Thanks, guys. Ride safe. See ya. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I wish the GoPro was on. Oh, it wait, is. It is. It is. It is. <laughs> Let's get the f out of here before they change their mind. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you like and subscribe for more.